Hi everyone and welcome to another NM Botronics tutorial. Uh, in the past I've shown you how to communicate between send a data signal rather from the Raspberry Pi over to the Arduino and have the Arduino receive that. And tonight I'm going to show you how to do just the opposite. Send a signal or data from the Arduino and receive it on the Raspberry Pi side. Uh, so here we go. Here's my sketch, real simple, for my Arduino. Uh, serial begin, 9600 baud rate. I do a serial print LN and just hello. And then I delay for one second. And as you can see here, hello, every second. Uh, let's see now. All right. Now, you're going to want to open up a terminal. We're going to install a few programs here. So, sudo apt uh, get install python. Now, I've already installed these, and so, but I'll just go through and show you how to do this. And then next, we're going to install uh, get install python one serial this will allow us to communicate over that uh, USB cord alright and after this now we're going to go out and get get something that's called grab serial so we're going to go w get http Yes, I will also uh, have this in the description. This address w.github user content com slash t bird twenty d grab serial. And then master grab serial again, and then we're going to do a space, and we're going to do grab serial one more time, and hit enter. Add a quote there. Get this little little program that'll help us get the serial uh, communication. So here we go. Now that's installed, um, we can we can go in and edit the file now. So we're going to go nano grab serial Oops. grab serial and we're going to hit control and W and then we're going to do a search for S D dot baud rate B A U D D R A T E. Hit enter. And here's what we're looking for the SD port, SD baud rate. Now, to get the port, when I open up my serial monitor, you can see right up here the address dev tty acm0. So, whoops, let's close that. So here, you have to make sure that that's the same address dev slash tty acm0 and your baud rate is going to be 9600 just like we had on the arduino and then you're going to hit control x and y to save it and get out of that and now now it's pretty much all done this is it so now all you're going to type in is python um, grab serial and hit enter and here we go we're receiving the data the hello alright and control C to get out of that now you can also add a timestamp to this so you can go uh, Python grab serial and do a pipe and then TS 
for timestamp and hit enter now it'll give you the date and the time along with the data that was sent over uh, control C again here's something that we can do too we can we can take and let's open up uh, open up here now I'm going to create a file in here uh, with grab serial so let's see now I'll get this over here so you can see the file getting created and we're going to go Python uh, grab serial serial and then we're gonna oh yeah let's put in the timestamp oops timestamp and that and then now we're gonna name our file so we're just gonna name it test dot uh, you can have any extension you want or whatever uh, I'm gonna go txt and hit enter now, we don't see anything coming up in the terminal anymore. Nothing's happening here. But, our test file got created. So, it's recording everything inside this file. And there you go. Quick, easy tutorial on how to receive data from the Arduino. Um, please like, subscribe, 